Hey there guys, gals, fans, and pals, another episode of Autonauts is coming at you. I tried to make it a song and I failed. Whew, okay, uh, vehicles. We ended on saplings, but I want to start looking at vehicles. Oh, okay, so actually now that I think about it, the mulberry trees we ended on last session is what grants us the... Infinite beehives? Yeah. Something like that. How's our weed work coming along? Oh, weed rific. That's good. Uh, we don't have a lot to go with, but that's okay. Maybe another collector? Uh, we, I'll, I'll come back to that. I'll come back to that. Uh, I would like all this road. Thank you very much. And where else were we doing more road? Yep, here. That looks so stupidly good, doesn't it? Yeah. Yeah, it does. Yeah, it does. I should have cut like this so it was symmetrical, but I don't think I care. Uh, we are going to just start removing as much of this as we possibly can. Hey, guess what, friend? I need you to do this, like, 30 more times. How much stone do we even have? Seven? Um, I could use another miner, probably. Yeah, let's get another miner going on. Uh, nope. Where? Yes, here we are. Uh, I think we have stone mine. Yes, we do. Have fun. Now, there was another beehive. I wanted to just get buttoned up. That's a mulberry tree. It is genuinely kind of hard to see when the sun is on my screen and it is nighttime, but that's okay. I could have sworn I saw just one more beehive. Uh, if not, maybe I just got to start cranking out mulberry trees and see how that pans out. I don't know what coaxes out a beehive. But I'm also not going to stress about it all too much right now. Uh, I'm kind of the mindset I wouldn't... Hey, hey, nice. Wouldn't mind to have a couple of the resources figured out, like beehives. Like, it's just one of those things I gotta sit down and collect for, I don't know, ten minutes and then we're done. Uh, or sheeps. Or chooks. Or cows. Or whatever. Full, full, yep, getting there. Okay, I'm happy with that. Here's your hammer. Nice, alright. How's the weeds now? I definitely need another weed collect. Okay, and with that, I'd like to work on some vehicles. Now, vehicles are under here, all the way over here. Vehicle assembly unit, and it needs to be in a house. Okay. Uh, let's just get a whole new area for that, yeah? How am I out of good flooring? Oh, wow. Uh, that's fun, fortunate. Uh, what do I have for walls? Nothing super good. Uh, this'll do to just get us started. It doesn't have to be perfect, but this'll just get us started. Uh, rot, dire, rot, dig, do, ba, do. Hoif! Floor. This is also technically a floor, and it will technically work, even if it technically sucks. Alright, keep your pants on, I'm working on it. Okay, what do I need for a wheelbarrow? Frame, wheel, axle, pull. Okay. First one I'll build myself. Now, if we can load the wheelbarrow and then dump it into a storage, that would be amazing. I, I would love it forever. 
I need two poles. So I'm building the first one just so I can uh, get I can talk. I can I can totally talk. Uh, I'm gonna build the first one so I can get a good idea of how this works. We can experiment and see what we're doing. Which one is crude wheel? Not you. Um, I think one of these will make me a crude wheel. Yep, cool. Okay, an axle, I think it's made over here by the shaping bench. Oh, I could have also used this for a crude wheel. All right. Uh, axle, a log and two poles. Easy squee. That is a heck of an axle, by the way. Cool. Control left click, take control, control right click, release control. Okay. Oh, I can't use it while on my scooter? Boo. Okay, let's see how this works. I want to collect a ton of weeds, for example. Okay, it's not. Okay, so. Control right click. Okay. 20. Okay. Uh, that's very reasonable. Okay. Now, can I just dump it into a storage? Like, that would be amazing. Holy crap, I can. The game has changed. Wowzers. Okay. So that makes place-to-place storage and movement almost trivial ha huh. yeah being able to dump it directly into storage changes everything um uh, hmm. yeah that makes going long distances amazing uh does this have durability by chance Okay, I can't delete it. I can't interact with it normally because the normal interactions are assuming I have uh, items in it. So let's just tr let's give this another try. I am very interested and curious. Uh, okay, let go. Oh, there's a beehive in there. Oh, I'll get to you in a moment, mister. Oh, there's a couple of beehives. Is there another one here? Oh, no, it's the shadow. Okay. Huh. I was like, how... How is this even happening? Okay. And then I'm just... Nope, put it back. And then right into the Moai head. It does not seem to want to work that way. What about this? Cool. Uh, that's pretty amazing. I like that very, very much. I'm just gonna park you right there. We're gonna go get a hammer and take care of that beehive. I don't want it to get chopped and then it's like weird organic rules and after a while it just disappears. Yeah, I don't want that. Cool. So, wow, let's think that through. When we get to our metallurgics area, and I need to move, like, a ton of metal from a place to place, I'll just load up a wheelbarrow and just... That's how we transport materials. That's super cool. I was really hoping it was going to work that way, and that makes it a lot easier for me. And that. That goes in that. Uh, what do we have for the beehives? I wouldn't mind to figure that out. Because right now I've just been using skeps. Which are just bigger beehives, it seems. 
Uh, maybe better shielded from the elements. You know, maybe a lot of good stuff comes out of it. Are we on our stone flooring, my man? We're getting there. I want to turn everything into this really nice stone floor, for sure. Nope. Thank you. Oh, what did it- oh, whoops. What is this even? Crude road, yeah. Uh, it requires sand. I haven't gotten there yet. Not much more, anyway. Uh, right now, just turning this from 15% to 30%, which is a, you know, double increase, which I like. Just want to get the main thoroughfares roaded up that way, so that way if we've got a lot of moving about, it makes things easier. Okay, that's still doing that. Uh, what else did I need for transportation? Crude wheel barrel use 3 of 10. Okay. Okay, I didn't think that was going to work. Does that count? It does. Unloading stuff counts. Cool. Alright. Simple transportation network. Uh, more variants I don't really care about. Cool. Stage 5 infrastructure complete. Good deal. That is super cool. Alright, let's uh, park it over here. Clothing is next. Let's do that. Robe made. 5 of 5. How do we make a robe? Uh, uh, crude clothing station. A toga, a bulrush cloth, a string makes a robe. Okay, we can do that. The only thing that we're not super good on is string, I don't think. What are you waiting on? You're waiting for string. Where's this guy? Uh, string maker. I need another two string makers. Uh, you know what I could do, which would be good for the wheelbarrow, is starting to transportate, transportate, transport weeds from our regular weed storage to like some other transient storage, but. I actually think I want to do this instead. String maker. Have fun. Okay. Bot master. Another five, please. Okay, we're gonna wait until we have more string, so I'm just gonna let that sit. Rock mass mind. Now, where in the world did I leave that pick? Oh, I think I know where. Nope, I don't know where. I thought it was over here. Oh, you know what? I think I used the pick for a masonry table? Something. That sounds familiar. Masonry table, or something. I don't know what it was called. Masonry bench. Yes, I did. Uh, we're gonna just cram that in there, because we absolutely can. Okay, I need a... All that's necessary. Or is it a good workbench that I make the thing I'm looking for? Uh, nope. Uh, that's our good workbench. So that goes away. Yes, crude blade, pole, wooden mallet. Well, guess what? I already have a wooden mallet I just stashed somewhere.
Okay, chisel and mallet. Nice. Let's go ahead and break up some more rock hard, hard rock mass, whatever. And then I'm guessing I take it to the masonry bench and it gets smooth. Let's go confirm that before I haul it all the way up here. Shaped stone block, and that's what I need? Yes, I do. Okay. Oh, uh, hang on. Nope. Okay, control click. Right, that's gonna take me a while to get used to. One of five! Oh my, that's... that saves so much time right there. Hit with a pick to release stones. Okay, so that's different than these. <laughs> All you can just see is my backpack. So we're going to get a lot of these little quests on, I'm thinking, this episode for sure. Please tell me I get still some amount of speed. Oh my god, amazing. Oh, uh, what if I... ...do this? Oh, I can't do that. Okay. Park that there, please. Okay, basic stone shaping, no problem. Block wall, stone block door, stone window, flagstone flooring, okay. Now this resource does not seem to be infinite. So I wonder how that's gonna go, gonna go down. Chimney, fireplace, which is what I need for the next level of cabin, but I require mortar. So maybe we work on that, uh, get that automated. M-O-R-T-A-R? Mortar. Mortar! Clay. Sand. Water. Mortar. Uh, sand and fresh water and clay are gonna be really close together, and I need a crude mortar mixer. Okay, how do I make a crude mortar mixer? Structure name. I'd like to... Nope. Not gonna let me? No, I want to I want to search for something. Planning mode? No, I don't want planning mode. Uh, where is a crude mortar mixer? Flagstone flooring doesn't give any speed upgrades. That's disappointing. There we are. Panel fixing peg pull. All right, let's make like two of these. Let's make like three of these. If I have the resources to make one, I like to make three, and that way I just have them ready to go. That way if it's like, oh man, I have one of these, I could really use like one or two more, then I just have them ready. Uh, three, four... Oops. There we go. Uh, now some panels. Panels are weird because this is going to turn into, like, a, a large bowl, right? I shouldn't need panels for that, but whatever. Thank goodness I have this automated. Oh, man. What a pain. Could you imagine? <laughs> we almost did go without automating it for a little bit, but nope. Okay. That goes away, thanks. I need two more pulls. Uh, okay, what I would like is more... Oh, we do have wooden flooring now. I wish I could just replace the flooring easily without having to tear it all up, but it doesn't matter. Um, okay, so, our crude mortar mixer. Uh, that wasn't in here, was it? A question mark? Yeah, okay. So, fresh water, clay, sand. We have clay here, we have fresh... Wait, this is fresh? Yes, we have fresh water here, so it makes the most sense that the production of this should be right around there-ish. Uh, what I would like is the bucket.
Um, I actually don't know if that makes any s Oh, we already have a bucket. Right. <laughs> right, I, I forgot. We have our little lake in a larger lake. That's what that was about. Okay, um, doesn't matter. Come here. We're gonna not use a barrel. We're just gonna use this mortar. Nope. Okay, you didn't finish getting the water. Okay. Let's make this very, very specific. Until hands are full, grab a bucket. Until hands are empty, get some water, put it in the thing. Done. Stop. Hi. Here you go. No need to abandon more buckets. Okay, next up. How you doing, bromide? Until hands are full. And then come over here. Until hands are empty. Uh, oops. That's more brains. That makes a lot more sense, doesn't it? Uh, forever? Go to town. Okay. That goes away. Now, the next thing I need is a bucket and sand. Do I still have that bucket down here somewhere? I do, actually. It looks like... I wish it would say what's in it. That looks like there's sand in that. Uh, even if it the picture says it's milk. Now, is there any other sand anywhere nearby, or is this the closest sand I can get my mitts on? There's some way north. Oh, it was actually empty. See, it looks white to me. Now it's... Okay, I don't care. It doesn't matter, it's fine. Um, I'd like to figure out how to store this, because I wouldn't mind a robot... To do haul oh wait oh can we do um uh is it a barrel oh okay cool it's just this uh get in okay my hands have to be empty all right fine fine um okay so how's this gonna fly as unintelligently as possible right uh, let's talk this out. I need a bot to go get a bucket and have a bucket. And then I need him to fill the wheelbarrow full of sand, bring the sand over to a place. How do I store sand? Is it like this? Nope. Is it like this? Yep, okay. That's how we do. Oh. I didn't know I could pull from storage. That makes this a little easier then. Um, hmm. Okay, we're gonna have this a two bot system. That drops. Uh, yes, I need a bot to do the harvesting and putting it in the silo. Uh, grab a bucket. Grab onto the a bucket. Yeah, I think that makes the most sense. So, a robot to load the bin. A robot to haul. A robot to unload. Or, well, the same robot that's loading will also be unloading. Uh, oh, let me think about that a second here. So, this...
Okay. You are going to make sure that sand is full ad infinitum. You are gonna... Where are we? Here we are. Wait, what happened? By nearest sand... Oh, whoops. Uh, stop. <laughs> I forgot the rest of the code, didn't I? Man, I'm a silly billy. Um, and unfortunately... Stop. Uh, drop everything. Can you move over? Thanks. Okay, now let's chat. Out of throw range. Come on, man, that's like five squares. Now try. Uh, the robot was stuck because the, em the bucket was full. Okay, that works for me. You are... Oh, I need you to stop. Sand load. Or sand harvest, I guess? Harvest sounds weird as a word for something that doesn't grow, but whatever. Um, good. Thanks. Continue. Yeah, I might want one or two more of those to keep up. Now, up here, I need a sister silo to deal with the incoming what's-its. Just like that looks fine to me. Uh, uh, five more bots, please. Okay, thanks. You're probably the one that got jettisoned midway. Yep, you are. Okay, now, first time with bots using vehicles. I don't know how this is going to work. Find nearest crude wheelbarrow, move to target, engage target. Okay. Until hands are full. So I guess I need vehicle storage, maybe. Maybe that might be cool, too. Um, but somewhere in there is fine. Now, load. Yep, take from sta stand. Stand storage. Good. Sand storage. Now, the wheelbarrow doesn't have any durability, I don't think. Squeak a 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 Okay. I think that's it. So now I'm going to go put this wheelbarrow down. Nope. Yep. Right here. And then we'll run it and see what happens. All he's got to do is just run sand from place to place. Look at him, a little scooty. Go get him, Scoots. Yeah, I could sip cuff coffee and watch this for a while. Cuff? Gosh, I can't talk. Cool. Okay, I don't need to watch this whole thing. Thanks. Uh, that works for me. Now... I need a robot to put the sand in the mortar mixer and then put the mortar away. Uh, yeah, okay. Oh, uh, right. Buckets. Buckets are a thing, man. <laughs> Keep forgetting I need buckets for everything. Uh, I can't imagine trying to cup my two bare paws of a hand of, of hands and just try to mangle some sand into a thing oh that sounds terrible okay until hands are full um this is kind of dumb but we'll do it this way anyway 
Um, I need you to pick up. I need you to place. Now the problem with my next idea is I was going to put the bucket in my backpack. But if it breaks right now, that might screw stuff up. Hmm. I don't want to use a whole nother robot just to move sand, or just to move mortar four squares. But I guess I'm gonna, just for simplicity's sake. Until hands empty, infinite, have fun. Oh, actually, I should have set them to be the logic bot on storage. Stop. Record. Until that is, let's say, 85% full forever. Okay, thanks. Okay. That'll do it. Oh. Okay, right, because it'd be a silo at this point, wouldn't it? Okay. Uh... Where's your bucket? Oh, it's in your right hand, and I can't see that while you're over there. Okay, that's fine. Okay, so I needed another robot anyway. <laughs> as dumb as this whole thing sounds, I'm gonna put this bucket back. Who knew, like, 90% of my production economy was going to be based on buckets, am I right? Uh, hey. Man, I, I hope you like buckets. Oh, jo oh, jolly. Oh, jolly, I hope you like buckets. Okay, now I have mortar. What did I need that for? Was it just for giggles? I don't remember. Um, oh, chimneys and stuff need mortar? Something? Uh, stone mortar, stone mortar, yep. Okay. Uh, well, stone is here, and mortar is here, so I guess that makes sense. Uh, just because of how much of a pita mortar is to move around, I might move stone making over there, because stone is easy to haul. Uh, do I need another? Oh, no, I need another hauler. Do I have a stone harvest? Stone mine? I don't have a stone harvest. Okay. Uh, who's responsible for this? Uh, this would be Stone Collect, actually. Pick up... Yeah, I want to talk to this guy. Stone Collect. I only have one guy collecting stuff? Really? That can't be right. What's your job? Stone mine, stone mine, stone mine, stone mine. Yes, I know I have four stone miners. Move to crude pick storage, find stone deposit. Oh, you're a stone mine. Okay, your just name is messed up. Um, yeah, let's get another stone collector. Uh... 
See, some of the miners aren't working because there's not enough room for it to happen. They won't mine if there's already stone there. And that's different from earlier versions I played. Because I have seen that happen. They'll just mine no matter... We don't care. We'll mine whatever the heck we want. <laughs> okay, that seems a little more streamlined. I'll take all of this. Thank you very much. And... Oh, it's overwriting something. There we go. Okay, cool. Very good. There's that. 17 mortar. All right. Now, I know I needed mortar because I know I need chimneys or fireplaces or something for the next tier of housing. That's why that was important. Our agriculture is looking good. How's that mulberry tree coming along? Uh, it looks like it's mature. There's no way to rotate the camera, is there? No. Oh, there is. I could do this. Uh, nope. There it is. Cute. Cute. Okay. It's not ready yet. For whatever I needed to do, it's not ready yet. That's no, fine. Uh, oh, there's the gladioli I was looking for. Be right back. I was like, in my brain, I'm like, I know I've seen this plant somewhere. And I know it's more common than just the two we found before. Yep, it's been right here this whole time. All right, I'm happy with that. Uh, uh, <clears throat> excuse me? <laughs> it was halfway through a hiccup and a something else, and I just completely lost it. Stone cottage built. Now, these seemed fairly straightforward to start building. Stone cottage, eight planks. Yeah, let's wait till that cleans up a bit more. Um, I know the second evolution is going to require a chimney and some other crap. I don't need any of this hewn block nonsense. And just move this. It needs good flooring. Okay, it doesn't need a wall, and that's fine. Oh, the products come with? That's... kinda neat. Um, I don't remember exactly what I need, so I'm gonna wait just a little bit. I need how many? How many folk do I have? I have five folk. So I'm gonna want five of these bad boys. Um, it is in here. Actually, I can't just upgrade these, can I? Probably not. Upgrading would be probably cool. Nope, that's... Okay. Okay, I can't interact with the house, so... Nope. Sorry, naked baby. I didn't mean to do that. Okay, that feels a lot better. Oh, how's our weeds? Very good. Uh, now, another case for the... What happened here? Why are you both sitting there? Some formula got jacked up, so I'm just gonna do this and force them to go get more weeds. Oh, wait. I know what the problem is. You don't have an actuator upgrade. That's our issue. Yep. Effector. An effector upgrade. Uh, two crude gears and a pole. That's our issue. Then 
number is always going to be off by one. So what I'll do is I'm going to get this guy upgraded. And then I'll go and I'll even out the formula. I'll even out the formula. And I'll make sure that it's again consistent 100%. Yep, that is exactly the issue. Uh, hi. You can have this. Thanks and have fun. Yep, that makes sense why that failed immediately. So now there was four already in the till. I only need one weed to fix it. So now he's going to put four more in there. And just sit there like a dumpy dump, right? Nope. Because you also... Don't have the thing. Yep, I need you to stop. Uh, I need one more weed. Yeah, so every time this was going to happen, we were going to be minus one weed. Okay, so now the other robot's going to go get it. And now this guy's just going to sit here. Well, good duh. That would be why we don't have any real... Oh, we have a lot of thread. What am I on about? Okay, there's that. Uh, string maker, I need you to come with me. What I really ought to do is I ought to designate the program stating a little more succinctly that it requires a memory upgrade. Uh, and right there, come to me. Okay, thanks. I thought that was a little too easy to do. It's an easy fix, though, so I'm not, not bugging about it, not even worried about it. Now we should be good. I'd just like to observe this for a minute and make sure that it is... Yep. Uh, nope, not you. Weed's loose. And to be absolutely honest, we're probably doing really well on weeds because all that other process was busted. Uh, I want to be over here... Cool. Perfect. Even if three or more robots show up, and they all put in their stuff, it's going to be multiple of five. So it'll just take a, it'll take a second or two to get that going on. Um, stop, come to me. Stop, come to me. Our two turf builders. That's all looking real good. Um, I'd like to be right over here. Okay. That works pretty nicely. Pretty nicely. I'm gonna move you guys over one square. So anytime I need anything dug, that's exactly what we're gonna have. Uh, these two robots are ready to go to move stuff and get stuff done. Mortar's looking good, 44. Uh, yeah, what other vehicles can I build? Can I build the... Uh... I still don't have a box frame yet. Ooh. Mobile liquid storage, that seems really cool. Yeah, I very much approve of all this. How much sand do we have? 44? Okay. And that guy's not waiting for, like, a specific amount. He's just going, going. So, yeah, he might only pull five, six every time, but it keeps a constant flow. And I don't want him to wait for maximum anyhow. Okay. Uh, very good. How are we on clay? We're full. The pots, that pot figure out thing we did earlier, that worked out real well, too. Okay, uh, let's get some production started. What do I need? What's next? I need a chimney? A, a chimney and a fireplace. Uh, that's going to require a lot of mortar, so I'm going to need a bucket, believe it or not. 
And unfortunately, this bucket is contaminated with fresh water. So we're gonna need another, 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 another new bucket. Ugh, boo. Thinking I might automate this, if I can. Well, at least it loads quickly. And I'll just go get 10 stone real quick. Um, if I only have to make these items once, automating it doesn't really make a whole lot of sense. Uh, I don't know why I have this on me, but I do. Maybe when I was harvesting plants ages ago. Okay, there's our five stone. I just want to see if I can uh, store this. Can I put this in here? No. A pallet. I can for a pallet. Okay, now that that's done... Okay, it can be stored. Uh, not too bad. Let's just check the same thing for fireplace. more trips, no big deal. And then if these items can be stored, I don't know how much more they're going to be used throughout the rest of the game. Uh, maybe automated a little bit? Um, I probably could use another stone manufactory. Cool. <laughs> Amazing. I could put an entire fireplace in a box. Neat. Doubly do right. That's what that voice is. Alright. Um, I kind of want to see what the next phase is, so let's do one chimney, one fireplace. What I'm going to guess is we're going to get to a point where we need, like, 40 folks. All the time, fed, clothed, the whole nine yards. And, oh, excuse me, little hiccups. Um, I'm going to have wished I automated this. Stone Cottage Blueprint 11284. We've done that many blueprints? Holy cripes. Okay, what's phase three? Hopefully a bunch of logs. A bunch of stone. Oh, gosh, it has six phases. How many do I need? Ten? Oh, our stone-making guy will finish it. Nice. I forgot about him for a second there. <laughs> Speaking of which, how much stone do we have? 87? Cool, we can do more stone uh, trails if we want. And one more? Hey, good guy. Okay, what's next? Log and stone, okay. Seems simple enough. Merci, mon frère. Oh, did I not get the log? Like, the log guy will eventually get to it, but I don't want to wait that long. Okay. Straw is level 8, which I will handle personally. Do 
door frame, window frame, two things I don't even have, which is fine. I think they're made over here in a, no. Door frame, what's that? Buttons? Wooden buttons, okay. Door frame, window frame? Nope. Um, probably a structural workbench, if I had to guess. Wood shaping bench, masonry bench, structural workbench, okay. Uh, well, we're gonna do this the smart way. Or fixing pegs. Stone pole, log, plank, all should be brought by robots. That goes away, and that goes away. And... I think that's out of everyone's range or something. Yep, that should wrap up pretty neatly. Maybe not. I should probably have two or three log constructors, but to be absolutely honest, uh, none of this is a rush. One more? You bringing me the last one, buddy? You are not. Ooh. Okay, I need a frame, window frame, how many of those? Two window frames. Let's get the two of these, two panels. For a window frame, I need panels? Weird. Doesn't matter. And we're gonna get four poles, so that way I already have some for the next operation. Um, I just want to complete this one structure, then we'll call it an episode. That goes in there. It's very heavy because it's two panels worth of heavy. So these would be fairly easy to automate. We'll pull this down a bit and we'll be able to do a few more fr the frames. And now I need a door frame. Two square frames, two panels. Man, I'm gonna need like a dedicated panel production manufacturers. I keep using that word. I like that word. I, I can't explain it. Um, I don't want to explain it, and I can't explain it. In that order. <laughs> Probably need more spades or shovels or whatever. Um, so with this, we'll have the next level of housing, we'll need to do the next level of cooking, and the next level of food. And that'll mostly wrap this up. Oh, toys as well I forgot about. Okay, making that was fairly straightforward. It is a level 4, it is a bigger thing, which is fine, takes up a bit more space, so I'll have to do a little reorganization. But I like that, that, that really adds to a proper shelter. And with these babies getting bigger, I mean, they're the size of half of the friggin' house already. Whew, okay. Let's go ahead and call this a break. Thank you all for joining me. My name is John Megacycle. Another episode of Autonauts is in the books, and I hope to catch you next time. Hey there, guys, gals, fans, and pals. Thanks for checking out my video. I also want to take a moment to thank all my supporters and donators, and if you'd like to join up with me and game with my crew, all the information to get connected is in the description below. Thanks again, and I hope to catch you next time.